recently a, a colleague of mine showed me a good trick of uh, adding these uh, grout, uh, grout fixtures under the walls so I was doing it the traditional old way like uh, I would just I can just change the color so that it's visible now so yeah see you see there's a precast wall uh, and then there's I need to add this grout so that it appears in these sections and everything so I was I was doing it like uh, in a traditional in an old-fashioned way like uh, I mean I would I would basically click on this end and this end and add that or maybe I would just go like this from this end to this this end and and, and you know then I would I would be at this location I would add it like this a little bit and then I would just keep going throughout the entire building uh, but it, it yeah that there would be some points that would won't be added correctly so here's a quick uh, tip that a colleague showed me and was very much impressed by the, the solution that, that the, uh, he showed so you see this little button here snap to edge and lines so you just click on that one and you'd see that when you click on, a, on an edge it'll show you an arrow so this this arrow is is from the left to right so when I click on this one and just click the middle mouse button it will draw that uh, that entire thing so for an instance if I click on this edge it will take it like this would be from left to right and my on plane is set from left to right so if I do it the right thing okay if I do this it, it comes over there so for an instance if I now want to draw these these lines I can just click on this edge my, my middle mouse button so look at that it's, it's just so quick and easy now so and it's 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 also the edges come up to the exact location so uh, i could i could probably just go around the entire building just just click like this it's good enough uh, if you want to have a small uh, if you have a small building that you just want to add some quick fixtures these lines are really nice like i could I could even have some kind of accessories modeled in this direction or something in case you want to do that but at the moment it's it's just use this button and keep clicking that's it so you need to know like this is the left so this is right side so it'll be like it'll it'll align everything from the left to right so you right to left so I'm just gonna click on this edge it's, it's gonna snap to that line anyways so I need to know which line I need to click on but yeah anyways Tecla gives you a visual feedback if you've done stuff correctly or not Alright, that's a quick tip. I hope you like it. Thank you.